people. Hi, yeah, hi. This, this is the dumbest intro I've ever done to a video. Just hi. Imagine giving an intro to a video by going hi. I'm an idiot. Whatever, okay. You, you're probably not here for n n knowing that I'm an You probably already know I'm an idiot. So just, yeah. So uh, this is my uh, pick series things. It's now week four. You can see in the top right of your screen my overall record. 35, 12, and 1, of course, is the Cardinals and Lions. Not the Giants. Ah! What is happening? The Cardinals and Lions in week one. Yeah. I'm not going to give myself a loss for that because that would, I mean, I'm not going to pick a tie. But if you're annoyed by that, just bump it up to 13 losses. So, um, yeah. So last week was my worst week yet. I got five games wrong. Which, I mean, I'll take it. Like, three weeks in, I mean, I'm so mad that the Lions beat the Eagles. Um, once again, the stupid Thursday night game. I even said I think that the Jaguars are going to win. <sighs> and I did. But just because of the first two weeks... I didn't pick them. So, yeah. What other ones did I miss? I missed the, um... Chargers game. Missed the Bucks game. Eagles. And one other one. The Colts game. So, yeah. But here are my picks for this week. Uh, the bold and underlines are the ones that I picked... So, first Thursday night game. Um, not sure what to say here because, um, I literally just barely changed my Eagles pick. Like, after I'd already finalized all my picks, I'm like, I went back in and I'm like, I kind of think the Packers are going to win now as much as I love the Eagles and I have Carson Wentz on my fantasy team as well as Alshon Jeffrey and Miles Sanders. Yeah. But, um, yeah. I've said the... Okay. Um, so I'm thinking, well, if I pick the Packers, either way I'm fine with. Packers win, I win the game in my first Thursday game. Eagles win, I'm happy because I like the Eagles. I'm not an Eagles fan. You'll find out which team I'm a fan of later, but... Yes. Titans-Falcons, I pick the Falcons because they are at home. I will, from now on, unless they are playing literally one of the worst teams, teams in the league never pick them again on the road because Matt Ryan cannot play on the road he's not a good player so yeah just yeah so I but I think that they can beat the Titans whatever um what, what am I whatevering I'm so confused so Browns and Ravens I think the Browns can win in Baltimore I mean I think this will be a close game. I kind of think the, the Browns can bounce back, even though they're insanely overhyped. Same with the Ravens, though. So, I mean, what else can I say? So, I... Mm, yeah, so I think the Browns will win. It should be a close game. Division, rivalry, not, it's not rivalry, but, you know. Um, and Patriots and Bills. I picked the Patriots. It's in Buffalo, so they got the home field advantage. We're going to see if Buffalo is actually a good team because they have beaten the Bengals, they've beaten the Giants, and they've beaten the Jets. Yeah. All bottom ten teams in the league, if not five. Jets probably aren't bottom. Actually, probably right now they're all bottom five teams in the league, so yeah. But, um, so yeah. I think the Patriots will win. We'll see if the Bills are actually good, though. Um, Chiefs and Lions. I picked the Chiefs because I think they're better than the Lions. That's all I have to say. I mean, they just came off of a win against Philadelphia. I'm just mad about that. 
But yeah, I think that the Chiefs can pull that away. Texans, I was kind of wrong about. I thought they kind of were a little overhyped, and I would have been a borderline playoff team. But now with Andrew Luck retiring, of course they're going to be a playoff team. Even if they didn't win their division, they were good enough to make the wild. And they were, the Colts would have allowed possibly two extra wins that they might not have gotten. So, I mean, who knows. But I still think they can beat the Panthers, who Kyle Allen, is that his name? The replacement for Cam Newton it is pretty dang good. So I hope I can continue seeing that because that was kind of fun to see. Uh, Raiders and Colts. Man. I don't know what to think of this Colts team right now. They are very, very interesting. Jacoby Brissett looks pretty good. Raiders, um, I have Josh Jacobs on my fantasy team. I hope he does good. And, uh, yeah. I think the Raiders can win. In Indy. It's kind of the upset of the week, I think, I have. But, yeah. So, moving on. Chargers Dolphins. Remember what I said about my favorite team? Yeah, it's the Dolphins. Haha. Uh -huh. I kind of think the Chargers are gonna win. I'm not just it's just a feeling though. Much as I hate to say it, I think the Chargers will win. I mean, yeah. Okay, fine. The Dolphins suck. Giants and Redskins. I think the Redskins can win. Even though, I mean, I still think it's just one good week against a horrible defense in the Bucks for Mr. Daniel Jones. So, I don't think he's that great. He's overrated. He's always been overrated. Except for when he got picked sixth. Then he was... Actually, no. By the people, he was... He was... Pretty correctly rated. So, I still think the Redskins can win. I sure dang hope they start Dwayne Haskins. But, yeah... Seahawks and Cardinals. Seahawks proved that they are not a good foot or very good football team last week. Lost to the Saints, who don't have Drew Brees, and it was at home with the twelfth freaking man. Coming off of a win against the Steelers, even though they lost Ben Roethlisberger, but still, um, I think the Cardinals can win. The Cardinals are going to be able to hang with any team. Plus, it's just an divisional game in Arizona. I think Cardinals can win. Or will win. Buccaneers, Rams. The Rams will win. Not much else I can say. Vikings and Bears. Also, this was the Buccaneers. I find it funny. I laughed when they lose. Even though I picked them to win. I laughed. I, well, I mean, inside it. I don't know. I had mixed feelings about it. So, you know, the Buccaneers have a rookie kicker in Matt Gay. They missed, like, three field goals and an extra point, and they lost by one. Yeah, he played for Utah in college. I'm a BYU fan. I hate Utah. I find that hilarious. I have told every single Utah fan I know about it, and I laughed at them. Oh, this guy's so amazing. He's the best kicker in the country, and he's going to go to the NFL and be one of the best kickers ever. And, um, yeah. The reason his team lost, he had four chances, I think. And, yeah, he, he screwed up. Buccaneers, get the frick rid of him. When a kicker's drafted, he's supposed to be amazing. He sucks. Yeah. Um, Vikings and Bears... I mean, divisional game in Chicago. I think the Bears can win because they're one of the best teams in the league, best defense in the league with the Vikings' um, horrible offensive line. I think that they'll win pretty, pretty, or not, uh, not easily, but they'll win. Uh, Jaguars, Broncos, that, well, this was another tough one, I think, but Jaguars, I think, can edge out Denver. Hopefully, I Minshew can do good again. I think if Minshew does good, Minshew's going to make or break this team until Foles come back, even though I think that Foles isn't very good and they should keep playing Minshew because he's a young quarterback. So, yeah. Uh, enough about the future. Right now, this game, I think the Jaguars are going to win. Broncos' defense has kind of been disappointing. 
and they're kind of just a depressing team right now. Uh, Cowboys and Saints, it hurts me so much to pick the Cowboys. I hate the Cowboys. I like the Saints. I originally had the Saints winning, and then I realized, oh, yeah, they have Drew Brees out, and um, the Cowboys have a good rush, so therefore they're going to be, be able to stop Alvin Kamara. And they have good, just a great defense in all, and they're going to be able to hang with Michael Thomas, and I just barely dropped Jared Cook from my fantasy team this week because uh, he sucks. So yeah, I, much as it hurts me, I think the Cowboys are going to win. Bengals and Steelers, this just kind of backfired on the NFL. Ben Roethlisberger gets hurt. This is now the most boring primetime matchup of the year, except for when the Steelers played the Dolphins on Monday Night Football. Assuming nothing weird happens. But yeah, I think it's safe to say the Steelers are going to win because the Bengals are one of the worst teams in the league. At this point, I'm probably picking the Dolphins to beat the Bengals. I don't think they play them this year. R.I.P. us, but yeah, whatever. So these are my picks. I'm going to go 16-0, making my record what next week? 51-12-1. That'd be pretty dang good. Probably not. Also, if you notice, there's kind of a pattern. It starts off two home teams, and then a ton of road teams, and then two home teams. Or, no, more than two home teams. Four home teams, and then, like, one, two, three, four, then home teams. So, like, there's five of six, actually, there's the 49ers and Jets have a bye this week. So, yeah, out of, so, yeah, that's not as weird as I thought. Anyway, just, yeah, see you guys in the next video. Bye, see ya.